A relatively new procedure could be a game changer for patients battling breast cancer. In our HealthCast today, we're taking a look at how it can melt the cancer away in less than one hour. The first thing that happens is the needle goes right through the cancer. Then the ice ball forms and, the, and we see this ice ball growing uh, under ultrasound guidance or MRI guidance. Right along this edge. This is cryoablation, a process that uses extreme cold to destroy tissue. So first the cells die when you freeze them and then when the ice ball melts, you see that you don't see it uh, during the imaging procedure, but the cells pretty much break off and spill their antigens. And that is the part that goes, that the immune system sees. Once the immune system sees the cancer cells, it can fight them off. Since the 1920s, the treatment for breast cancer has been surgical. But with technological advancements and better understanding, specialists like Dr. Luz can now use the cold to help fight certain breast cancers. It is less invasive than having your teeth clean. Last month, 86-year-old Helen Streaker was diagnosed with breast cancer for a third time in her life. She was a poor surgical risk and not a good candidate for chemo or radiation. Instead, she had a second round of cryoablation with Dr. Venta. This is a photo of the incision. Look at that. Look at my fingernail. How small. And Helen is spreading the word. It has been my passion to tell people about this because I don't want women to have unnecessary surgery. What a big advancement there. Cryoablation, this procedure is done on an outpatient basis and typically takes less than one hour.